بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ان دیز ویڈیو وی آر گوئنگ ٹو گیو دی فل کورس آف آرڈنری ڈیفرینشیل ایکویشن از کورس آف بی ایس این ایم ای سی in Pakistan universities and uh, we are going to give simple concepts of uh, simple concepts and uh, solutions solution methods of diff uh, ordinary differential equation so we start with the uh, types of uh, ordinary uh, ordinary and partial differential equation basically what is a differential equation differential equation is in is in fact and a simple definition uh, simple definition of uh, um, uh, differential equation it is uh, it is a dynamical equation that is a simple uh, simple definition of uh, a differential equation in this type of differential equation um, uh, one variable is changing with respect to other uh, and it is also uh, we can also call it evolutionary uh, uh, equation because one uh, um, one variable one variable evolve with respect to other and so one variable so ty types of uh, types so basically there are two types ordinary ordinary differential equation ODEs and uh, PDAs partial differential equations uh, ordinary differential equation and partial differential equation so then uh, there are <coughs> linear linear and nonlinear so ODEs or PDEs ordinary differential equation are partial differential equations so what are linear in so let's uh, let um, differentiate between these two linear and nonlinear linear differential equation are very easy to understand and very easy to solve but non-linear differential equations are difficult to solve so I am giving uh, um, example for the non-linear differential equation a differential equation uh, will be non-linear if uh, uh, so non-linear if um, there is a power other than one on the uh, on the dependent variable let's see uh, y dash uh, is equal to y square this is non-linear because of this square similarly let's say and it it apply to higher order differential equation as well if you have power of y other than uh, power of y or power of dependent variable other than one uh, it will be a nonlinear differential equation similarly you can say if we have product of um, uh, def derivative and uh, the dependent variable and let's say it is x equal to x it is again nonlinear because of this product and we have another uh, example y is equal to uh, 
let's say sin y it is also non-linear because of this sign of the dependent variable so these are uh, the three types of the non-linear differential equation if you have power if you have power of the dependent variable other than one that is non-linearity if you have product of derivative and uh, dependent variable like this one this will be non-linearity of the differential equation and uh, if you have transcendental function uh, that means transcendental for log y sine y cos y or hyperbolic wise so then exponential y uh, they are non-linear differential equations so this is simple uh, concept of the uh, non-linear uh, differential equation if we have equation other than these types then then they will be considered um, they will be considered linear let uh, me give you some uh, uh, non-linear PDEs uh, so this is one two and three types of non-linearity in the ODEs and you see the same rule same rule if lie here if lie on PDs as well so if we have a PDE let's say you x x plus u square equal to 0 it is nonlinear because of the power of u other than uh, one and uh, you see if you have product uh, u u x x plus um, some x or x equal to zero is nonlinear because of this term uh, the product of the uh, where u u is a function of t and x. Uh, Similarly, if you have um, some function, uh, if you have u x x uh, uh, plus sine u that equal to zero is again um, uh, nonlinear because of uh, this uh, transcendental function of the dependent variable. So, uh, if you separate nonlinear from linear. The, it is easy to separate nonlinear types so, and uh, the remaining will be linear so now I am going to give you some uh, linear PDs and ODs you see uh, y dash um, plus y is equal to let's say sin x this is first order first order linear and uh, let's say um, general first order linear should be of this type um, a 1 of x y dash plus a naught of x y is equal to some function of x f of x this is a um, now this is linear general Uh, linear first order OD. Similarly, we can give um, nth order linear. Nth order mean as a, there will be a n of x y n plus a n minus one of x y n minus 1 n up to a naught of x y a naught of x y is equal to some function of x this is nth order order linear ODE ODE 
similarly we have um, uh, linear PDs let's say u of t x t plus u of x and there should be some function let's say a1 up uh, let's say trx um, are both tx uh, another function um, x of t of x is equal to so let's say some function f of t and x this is linear linear in u and uh, let uh, me give you uh, let me give you some second order linear uh, general second order linear PDE uh, general will be uh, let's say a2 a2 u xx a uh, 1 u x a nod u plus b2 u t t b1 u t plus b naught u all oh, that is counted over here but let's say this is i'm skipping this one because a naught u is here is equal to some function and let take that function to be g of t x this is second order this is second order linear uh, linear PDE and we can generalize it we are a i's and b i's are function of t and x generally so that's uh, uh, the end of this video i will give uh, approximately eight to ten minutes video so that easy to read and watch thank you very much